All right, I picked up some of these Black Rhino 625 needle dart kits. Kind of a, uh, well, reminiscence from when you used to fire the 40 cals. These are really just a giant version of the 40 cal dart. And in fact, they have the little spearheads. I actually thought the spearheads would be, well, quite a bit bigger. They seem to be okay. They don't come with any instructions or anything, of course. You know, what does these days? It looks like what the, the hole in these things actually could be is a little larger than the cones. I don't know if we can get to where you could actually see that. But when you press the wire all the way in there, they do seem to stay. I haven't fired any yet. I'm just busy putting a few together here. I'm not going to fire any of the... Not going to fire any of the... Um, well, the little broadheads. So I fired them into my styrofoam and I don't want to have to dig them out. Because I'm sure that they'll probably come off. But I don't know about that. But, why don't we go ahead, since I have about... Oh... Five or six of these. Well, about six of these up. Let's go ahead and see how they do fire. All right. All right just because I have it handy, I'm using the big old seven foot. Yeah, that's a um, five foot two piece cold steel with an extension on. When I put the extension on, I always wrap a little on my electric tape around there. After pressing it down tight and then wrapping the electric tape around it while it's on. That oil fits a lot better. There's no um, air loss. Of course it would be a big deal. Alright, well, they fit in the barrel fine. Okay. Oh! You know the little ad for these that say, you know, the big old heavy dart takes you have to put so much air behind it. And you can almost put these out of the barrel with barely breathing. I don't know how much they weigh yet. I think I need to go figure that out. Put them on scale. But they do seem. They don't drop any. That's a notice. I'm I'm here. I'm firing at 25 yards right here. The um, cold steel darts have a noticeable drop. In fact, I've learned to raise a little bit. And in fact, I'm actually hitting low in there because I'm firing low. Weird. The stop inside the um, inside the cold steel um, mouthpiece there works very well. I just sucked it back a little bit and it stopped it right up against it and I actually had to push it back in. Which being such a light dart, I kind of forgot that that's a little bit more of a worry. Alright. Well, you can see from here that um, really wasn't a very good target firing, but